around the globe are videos. What the heck is this? It's moving. Photos and sounds that defy explanation. Is it some kind of unidentified object? Are we looking at something that's CGI? What are they? Some sort of bizarre mutation. Extraordinary claims need extraordinary proof. I'm Tony Harris, and as a journalist for more than 30 years, I've followed the facts where they take me. Now I'm bringing that spirit of investigation to the world's strangest sounds and images. We'll analyze each one with top experts. It's a credible case, it's a credible video. And pass a verdict on what it is. This video was clearly faked. The proof starts now. Tony, good morning. Jeff, you're up early, brother. Oh, boy, just for you, man. man I got to know the truth. What's out there, right? <laughs> well, we're going to hit you with a shot of energy, brother. Yeah. Oh, I'm I'm ready for it. I'm ready for it. Thank you for joining me today. I mean, I love this series, and congratulations on season two. But I have to ask you, is separating the real from the fake, is it getting more difficult? Well, look, I think you make a really good point. Um, there are There are people out there who are looking for likes and, and, and hits and, and they're creating amazing fakes and hoaxes. So I, I think that's one of the reasons a show like ours exists and works. It works on that level of, of trying to discern what's real and what's fake. And, and we don't hesitate to call out the hoaxes and the fakesters and the fraudsters. And, and that actually provides a pretty good moment for me to sort of, you know, to riff <laughs> and, and to have some fun blasting folks who are creating, you know, these fakes. Because the serious side of this is that there are people who are working in this space who are serious minded and are trying to get to the bottom of, of, of what else is out there in the universe. Not, not just this universe, but other universes, right? And so that's really serious work. And, and when you think about the people who are taking this time to create these elaborate fakes, you know, we, we call them out. But it's a very good question because part of the reason that, that we exist is to separate, you know, fact from fiction. And when we don't know, you know, we say so. We, we, we do that on, on every episode. And this season you have some great cases, like some strange lights over Norway that have gone unexplained. Yeah, yeah. I, I think this was a really, really strong season. And, and what we're finding, we're obviously a crowdsourced show, right? So we, we tell everyone at the end of, of every episode, let's see if I can find it here to, you know, to, to, keep those, to keep those cameras rolling, right? And so we're crowdsourced and people send us all kinds of material. And they're settling into essentially three different buckets. There's the stuff that's in the skies, obviously, and, and the lights and whatever they might see, the objects. Um, and, and then there's what's on the land and then what they see in the water. And I'm fascinated mostly by what I see uh, in the videos coming from people who have captured things in the sky and in the water, because, you know, there's still so much to learn, right, about what's in the seas, right, and what's in the sky. So I'm really fascinated by that material. And, and you're going to see stories in all three of those those buckets this season and you know the way people engage with the show i know they're going to be writing me and <laughs> filling my dms and twitter with their comments uh the engagement is crazy and it's fun and in and, and a final minute here that we have can you tell me is there a particular case that keeps you up at night no i you know i i, I often not that keeps me up at night and and Adjacent to that is the idea of whether or not I've seen anything in all the material that that we get in uh, that scared me. And no, I I haven't been frightened at all by anything that I've seen. I haven't been scared by anything. I, I'm, I'm more just sort of fascinated because there's just so much that we don't know. And hopefully if people like us, it, it's because we're showing them a, a side of the planet they live on that they're unaware of. Um, and so at this point, Although I should maybe modify that a bit. We just finished season three. And uh, there's some stuff coming in season three that it's borderline. So oh, that's um, a... so far, so good. 
All right, Tony, congratulations. Until then, we have season two on the History Channel. The proof is out there. We'll talk again for season three. Come visit us in Las Vegas. We'd love to have you. And it's always oh, a pleasure, man. Thank you. I would love that. Thank you. Appreciate you.